Not everybody's going to bed alone. Some people are going to bed alone. Some people are going to bed with company. Hey besties, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sheree. Welcome. If you're returning, I love you like I love cooked food. Welcome back, dwelling. Today we are talking about bedtime fragrances, fragrances that are perfect for sleeping in. And I've been on this vanilla kick lately, so if you want to see what they are, please continue to watch here on this channel. I do cover fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle, all things fancy and fabulous dwelling. So if this seems like your vibe or your zhuzh, first and foremost, drop me your scent of the day because I want to know what you're wearing. Or better yet, drop me what are you sleeping in. I want to know what are you sleeping in. This is a video request. Request, and this video request did come from Whitney Davis 9423 her video request was can you give us an updated version on your bedtime fragrances so I have you covered Whitney thank you so much for your video request if you have a video request be sure to leave it down in the comment section below all right you guys let's jump right in don't forget to hit the subscribe button did I say that already don't forget to hit the subscribe button oh and come over and say hi on Instagram you guys I'm gonna lose light here at some point so I'm gonna fix it so don't worry about that if you see a change but anyways when you're going to bed you have to ask yourself like what do I feel like sleeping in? A lot of times when I'm going to bed, I need to be calm down. I love lavender scents. I love like freshens. I've shared that with you guys before. I'll pop a picture up. I love the lavender. I love the vanilla. Those are the fragrance scents notes that it's at for me right now. I love sleeping in vanilla. House of Siage, I have a ton of their fragrances to share with you because they have the vanilla base in there and it's very soothing. I like comforting scents, musky scents, not too much floral, but I do like more of like, like sandalwood, tonka bean. These are just notes if you know them amber um i don't like too much of a gourmand scent like i don't want to go to bed smelling like a whole bunch of gourmand chocolate crunch covered snacks i, I, mm -mm, I don't want to do that but i do love vanilla vanilla is soothing it's comforting and i told you i've been on this cherry kick lately so i have been sleeping in cherry and vanilla it's just been working for me so those are the ones that i'm going to share with you today we're not going to spend a whole lot of time because i got like 14 fragrances and we don't have time to be here all day all right i love sleeping in 100 silent ways i talk about this fragrance all the time this is one that if I do sleep in it, I'm not going to spray it heavy. I'm going to spray maybe two, maybe two. And definitely that's going to be enough because this can be a bit strong. But if you spray it properly, it's a really nice, soothing, comforting vanilla type fragrance to sleep in. Inside of this fragrance, we have vanilla, peach, tuberose, iris, gardenia. It's a beautiful, elegant fragrance. It does have some patchouli, but it's a beautiful fragrance. Like I said, if you're going to sleep in it, don't over spray it. Tip two for me. I don't like fragrances that make me feel ans antsy or anxious like I need to get up and go somewhere I slept in fragrances before and the whole night I was like oh my gosh like I'm purring in my sleep I'm like turning over like oh purring I need to be somewhere I need to do my makeup I need to get dressed I need to get out I don't like those kind of fragrances for sleeping in there's a time and a place and they're not for my bedroom well they're not for sleeping let that go let that go when I get out of the shower especially if I shower at night and I'm getting ready to turn down my bed do my facial routine, everything like that, like candles. I like something soothing. So ask yourself and leave it in the comment section right now. What type of fragrances do you like to sleep in? Do you like fresh, clean? Do you like soothing, comforting? Do you like more musky? Do you like more um, gourmand? Do you like more cakes, pies, chocolates, different notes like that? Are you more of a fruity person? Are you more of a floral person? I want to hear from you. If you don't know, just look at some of the fragrances that you gravitate to sleep in and see what some of the notes are in them. That will be a good indication for you okay another one I talk about this one a lot as well you guys this is Scarlet Poppy this is Fig this is Scarlet Poppy this is by Joe Malone I talk about this all the time it has vanilla and tonka bean in it as well it's soothing it's not going to disturb the peace I don't want anything long lasting this is not uh when I go to bed I'm not looking for something to be beast mode this is not the time that I'm trying to turn up beast mode I needed to project last 12 plus hours it's not the time for that I'm going to bed I just want to smell good and I need scents to help me fall asleep because it helps me to feel comfortable so something like this I told you guys before I sleep in this and I mix it oftentimes with this is cardamom and mimosa by Joe Malone I speak about it all the time I mix the two of these together sometime and wear them as well really good combo like I said cherry vanilla fragrance amber rouge smoking I sleep in this a lot I tell you guys that all the time too so these are the type of notes that I like to sleep in like if you're laying in bed at night and you turn over and you get that poke <laughs> somebody taps you you could probably be wearing something like this and it wouldn't disturb the peace it wouldn't like <laughs> 
it wouldn't be off putting this one right here is really really good i need to turn the lights up it's getting dark okay hold up so you would not be disappointed with rouge smoking another one that's going to be in that same family is velvet tonka i told you guys when i got this i was like oh my gosh and i didn't know it was such a woody fragrance as well it's vanilla it's amber it's got almond i believe it's got tobacco down in the base this is a really good fragrance i only really reach for this to sleep in i rarely ever wear this out it's just comforting to me this is another one that can get you that <laughs> excuse me in the middle of the night and it wouldn't be off putting i just gotta say because not everybody's going to bed alone some people are going to bed alone some people are going to bed with company this would not be off putting and it would not disturb the peace so i'm just saying if you're looking for something in that realm this would be a nice way to go as well and it's very comforting i move on now this is not gonna get you the poke in the middle of the night maybe it will i don't know i don't know who's poking you in the middle of the night just keep some things to yourself i'm just saying this right here is sherwood memo and this i did pick up or receive from twisted lily and it's really really good you guys i love this for sleeping in it's so soothing if you love like sandalwood a good powdery fragrance this is the way to go it's so comforting i love this from the moment i got it it was just in a recent video love at first sniff black currant pink pepper orange blossom it has spices rose it is a beautiful fragrance i do have a 10 percent off discount code i received this from twisted lily and i can help you save 10 percent off it'll definitely be linked in the description box below another one i should have named this video vanilla i, I like vanilla you guys when i look at my fragrances and i go through i'm like all of these have like vanilla and I'm like, it's like the keynote. This is another one that is really super good. This is newer to my collection, but I have been sleeping in this. This is vanilla powder, another beautiful, beautiful fragrance. It's vanilla, musk, coconut, and it has Palo Santo down in the base. So it has a little bit more than just your vanilla. You do smell the coconut. It's not too in your face, but it's really nice. It's really inviting. This you could even wear like on a date night. I don't even have any more places to spray. Yeah, this is good, but it's not heavy at all, but it has a great presence. This is, okay, so, okay, go with me, go with me. Do we have a 2.5? This is like where you've taken your shower and maybe you're gonna go down and hang out and mosey around the house a little bit. It's not too warm in the house. It's kind of really chilly. You might even have your robe on. You spritz something like this on. Make sure you always put a hydrating body oil or some type of moisturizing, shea moisturizer because it's ashy season, crack season, dry season right now. So make sure you moisturize and then put on your perfume so that it has something to stick to, something to hold on to. So after you've done that, you come down, you've had this on. Once this warms up on the body chemistry and it's been on it for a while, this can get it. Like this is good. This is, this is one that you can just, this is a good one. <laughs> this is vanilla powder. I got to go. You, when I talk about lotioning or pairing your fragrances together, this is vanilla amber um, or amber vanilla. Vanilla. This is the Eau Tea or the Eau Toilette by uh, Laura Mercier. Mercier. And it's really good. So this is a body cream that it comes with. I got this in a set. I think I picked it up at Nordstrom, if I'm not mistaken. I received this in a set. The body cream in here, it's very supple. And it's very, oh God, oh, I needed some lotion. I told you it's dry crack ashy season but it's really nice it's very hydrating so you'd put something like this on never apply your fragrance to just dry skin you know what i mean you always want to hydrate and once you put it on go ahead and take your fragrance i like to put it on just like we do our makeup you know how you go ahead and put your primer on and then while it's still tacky a little bit then you go in with your foundation or concealer or what have you i apply my fragrance the same way why the lotion is still on the moisturizer the body cream whatever the heck you want to use while it's still tacky you can still see it there so it hasn't completely went into the skin yet i will go ahead and spray it and don't rub it together i have to say that because i still see so many people rubbing it together yes they say it disturbs the molecules the blah 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 but we have enough we can go this side and this side you see that because we have a whole bottle here <laughs> I'm just saying, you don't have to rub it together. Just spray it and spray. Oh, that is so good. And so comforting. Oh, this is good. This is one, you guys. This one stills the show. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I haven't got to the other ones yet. But this is really a good one. I'm going to link it. If you have not tried it, I would highly recommend it. You can wear this as a signature scent. This is signature scent worthy. This is work appropriate. This is date night, day date, evening date, brunch, church, work, school picking up the kids from school. I mean, you name it, you can wear this. This is a one and done. This is good. Other than sleeping in, 
vanilla fragrances, more musky, more comforting, more cozy fragrances. I love sleeping in fruity fragrances, but basically not Monday through Thursday. I only, I know I'm so, I'm like that, okay? I, if you're like that, I'm very much meticulous. I have a rhyme, reason, routine for everything. I don't wanna be thinking about fruity stuff because it gets me excited. I think I'm going out. I think something fun is about to happen. Monday through Thursday is very mundane, okay? We do what we do. We gotta do what we have to do. So at the end of the day and on the weekend, we can do what we wanna do. If you got that, hit the like button button if you didn't it's okay hit the subscribe it really doesn't matter over here we just smash buttons so go ahead take a 2.5 and smash that button okay 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 so anyways on the weekends or leading into the weekend i like sleeping in fruity fragrances i do i do i do i do i do see passion eclat is one that i love sleeping in ask me where it is go ahead ask me where it is gone I don't have it and I haven't been able to find it. You guys were supposed to help me out. Did you find it? Did they discontinue it? I can't find it. I can find the regular one, but I cannot find the Eclat. And that one, I really love sleeping. I'll pop a picture up in case you don't know what I'm talking about. And then I also love sleeping in this. And this is about to be gone, but thank gosh, this is still available at Sephora, Nordstrom's, Macy's. I can still pick this up. This is Burberry. Burberry, her, the original one, all the berries, the strawberries. It's just a beautiful fruity fragrance to sleep in and it makes me happy. And I love it and this is another one that might get you that in the middle of the night you sleep <laughs> no I'm up what's up <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. oh my god another one I told you guys about this one whoa the dent in here is getting real I sleep in this a lot too because it's another one that's a fruity fragrance that makes me happy it's by the brand nest I picked it up at Sephora rose pear raspberry apricot jasmine it's a very fruity fragrance it's long lasting on me I can use this as a room scent sometime too before getting into bed depending on if I'm gonna change the linen maybe the next day or do um, like a load of laundry and I'm gonna be washing the linen I will spray this all over my sheets I do all white everything because I just love the color white and you can see what's on it so I love white sheets. So I will go ahead and take this and I will miss the bedroom. Do you guys miss your bedroom? So I'll go in when I say prepare the bedroom. This is what helps me to get a better night's sleep. And if you guys are not watching the vlogs, you're missing out because in those vlogs, I'm sharing with you uh, different things, different fragrances, how I'm using different fragrances, more lifestyle fragrances. And also I shared with you the mocktail the sleepy girl mocktail. So I've been getting the best night's sleep and I'm using Ollie. Is it Ollie? Yeah, and these other ones that I found at, um, oh, oh, Home Goods. I went back into Home Goods. I found the uh, other sleeping, I think it's magnesium. I don't know what it's called. And they are amazing for getting a great night's sleep. I have the worst time and the hardest time turning off all this and getting it to calm down and relax. So the Sleepy Girl Mocktail, the Oli um, gummies, what else is it? Oh, and these other gummies that I'll share with you, they have been helping. I have been getting some of the best night rest. Yeah, I've been getting some of the best sleep and I contribute it to that and then my bedtime routine. So I'll go in, I do my face I do brush my teeth uh, pin my hair up tie my hair up do all that different stuff and that takes kind of a, a little bit of time for me and I enjoy it so I will not go to bed and I will not you know forsake my skincare routine I just can't do it I can't do it so then I'll go in and I turn down the duvet turn down the covers because we don't sleep with the duvet we don't sleep with the top covers we don't sleep with the 18 pillows on top of the bed okay they're just to look at they're just for decoration so I have to take all that out the bed and put it on my um what is it called oh god Oh, the chase. <laughs> look at that, look at that. After I put all the pillows and all the duvet and everything on the chase, then I go in with the blankets and the cover we actually sleep with. The sheets. A satin pillowcase, ladies. Gentlemen, it doesn't matter. Satin pillowcase, skin, hair, keeping it thriving and alive. Satin pillowcase. I'll go in, not on my pillowcase, but just on the sheets and everything. I will mist it like this, you know, just stand far away and just... I'm just wasting this and just <laughs> just missed your sheets and then I have a um what is it called oh god <sighs> you know that I don't know the name of it. a diffuser I have a diffuser in my bedroom as well so that's going I've got candles lit it's really pretty you can't help but get a great night's rest so that's what I do I use this for that a lot and then coming over into these three I have been sleeping in these like crazy I have been sleeping in these ever since I got them so I've had them for a while except for one and I've been sleeping in it um huff puff I'm just gonna give it to you like this this has the dent in it that it has in it and this dent has been made within the last month and a half I would say and it's because this fragrance is really good you guys if you don't have it I would highly recommend it um it goes on sale with House of Siage a lot I do have a disc no I don't have a discount code but I do have a link so the link is going to be linked in the description box below but they're always on sale and if you're following me on Instagram or the community page here I'm always letting you guys know when they're 40 50 percent off I've seen not this one but I have seen House of Siage 
run up to 60% off sometimes. So definitely turn on your post notification bell so that you can be alerted and you can get a savings, okay? But this Huff Puff is good. I wrote down the notes because I didn't even know. I'm like, why do I love this so much? It's vanilla, coconut, peach, and gardenia. Don't know. Those notes say nothing to me, all except the vanilla. But the fragrance, oh God. It kind of smells like devotion. It kind of smells like Lyra. It kind of smells like, um, I don't know, just vanilla and creamy and rich and decadent and strong, but it's so soothing. And at the same time, it's so sexy. Just get your nose on it. I can't stay here all day, you guys, this is good. Another one is Cream Chiffon. Remember when this came out? Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is another one. I don't talk about these a lot because I sleep in them. So you see the dent in it. This came out, I don't remember when it came out. House of Siage, I love this one. This is Cream Chiffon. I sleep in this a lot. I wrote the notes down. It's vanilla, it's powdery, it's amber, it's brown sugar, it's whipped cream, it's marshmallow. Another beautiful, cozy, decadent, snack time kind of fragrance it's really good oh yes yeah, these just remind me of going to bed. WW84, you already know if you've been here for any amount of time that I fell in love with this fragrance when it first came out. This was the first fragrance that I wore back outside during our time of trials and tribulations. But thank you, Jesus. Hello, hello, somebody. Anyways, um, the dent is denting. This is, it has a few more sprays. I think I sleep in this almost every night. Like, no matter what I put on nine times out of 10, if I walk back in my closet or in my bedroom area, I'm gonna spritz this on again. It's just habit, you know, at this point it's just habit and i love this this is a sweet vanilla amber musky fragrance vanilla is what i get more than anything it's very soothing any of these can be worn anywhere if you're a vanilla lover if you're kind of a, i wouldn't say gourmand really but i guess you could but they don't make me think of food maybe a sugar cookie a little bit i don't know not really no I get that brown sugar note. It's something warm, sweet, and decadent like a snack, but, but not that kind of snack. Not a snack worth a lot of calories, okay? Not that kind of snack, but it is really, really, really good. And that's what I'm sleeping in. Those are the fragrances that I reach for. What's my time? Oh yeah. So those are the fragrances that I'm reaching for at nighttime when I'm going to bed or if I'm going to be cozied up in the house and I'm really not going anywhere for the rest of the day. I've done everything. I just want to chill and hang out because it's cold. That's what I'm reaching for. I'll probably do these by quarter because when the months get warmer, I probably won't be reaching for some of the warmer, warmer ones as much, but that's it. Thank you so much, Whitney, for your video requests. You guys, if you have any video requests or any videos that you like to see, please do not hesitate to leave them down in the comment section below. That is it for this video. I will see you beautiful souls in the next one. Do not forget to leave me down in the comment section below. What are you sleeping in? I want to hear from you. I want to know. I love you like cooked food. I'll see you in the next one. Until next time, you know the drill. Be blessed. Stay fit. And definitely stay fabulous, darlings. Thanks for watching. Bye.